Brampton real estate down 26.9% stay tuned in today's video we're gonna discuss a lot of good stuff hey my name is Ashish Sharma I'm your realtor with right at home realty brokerage in today's video we're gonna discuss market updates for Peel region which has city of Brampton town of Caledon and city of Mississauga let's unlock real estate Okay, so let's start with city of Brampton, uh, which is the first city we will cover in Peel region. So let's talk about the average price. So average price has declined by 12.3% year over year in city of Brampton for the month of November 2022. And as you can see, the there is a sharp decline in the number of sales and that is around 65.5%. Wow. 65.5% year over year over year number of sales has been declined and as you can see that this year in the month of November for the last 10 year data for November like it has hit the lowest lowest and especially like God knows what's gonna happen moving forward as interest rate hike just happened the seventh interest rate hike also has happened so this is the data for the median price for your reference and let's talk about the uh, housing breakdown in city of Brampton for this month so around 50% of the properties sold in city of Brampton was detached property and currently uh, detached properties are averaging around 1.2 million and let's if we hover over uh, the data over here for the last 12 month average currently the last 12 month average is sitting around 1.1 million or 1.2 million you can call it like on an average uh, in city of Brampton across all properties but if we have to compare it from month by month as you can see like this is continuously like touching the new bottom May, June, July, August, September, October, November like if we compare month by month there is a drop of like only 0.4 percent but if we compare the data big drop from the peak which happened in city of Brampton in the month of January this drop is 26.9 percent yes you heard it right from 1.4 million to around 1 million the properties has been right now averaging over there and we have seen a decline of 26.9 percent in the average price in this month in city of Brampton for the last 12 months technically if we see it right for the market peak in Brampton in January and right now it's in November and 26.9 percent prices has been slashed and if we talk about the month of inventory over here currently the month of inventory for city of Brampton is sitting around 3.1 and the average days on market it is taking around 20 days to uh, get the home sold so if we jump on the next uh, on our list uh, which is town of Caledon the average price of town of Caledon also saw a big cut by 13.4 percent year over year though the number of sales was already continuously declining for the last two years and the big it's not a big drop but still like 33.3 percent drop year over year in number of sales as well as you can see like majority of uh, only 56 properties exchange hand in the month of November for Caledon and out of those 40 properties were like detached properties and the average price currently averaging around 1.58 million no doubt why Caledon is uh, hitting that uh, ranking of our GTA because ma majority of the houses over here are big houses and uh, they are selling for big ticket items so if we go with the average price and compare the month over month over here from the October month to November month the average price has we have seen a decline of 19.9 percent month over month that's a hefty decline I would say like in month of October properties were selling for 1.7 million and right now it's selling for 1.4 ish right and if we talk about month of inventory it's currently sitting at 4 and average days is 26 for sure better than the July but it is for sure the buyers market right now we are in and if we had to talk about the Mississauga yes for that uh, if we have to talk about city of Mississauga the average price didn't see that much decline in uh, city of Mississauga the average price only declined by 1.64 percent year over year but number of sale has took a deep decline by like 49.6 percent better than 
Brampton, though Brampton saw like 65% decline and that was huge to be honest. And if we see the numbers over here, like uh, majority of the houses selling are detached again by averaging at 1.43 and the other uh, then semi detached uh, uh, the other one which is selling like 45 properties exchange hand and the current uh, averaging at 0.98 million and uh, condo townhouse we have seen a big uh, jump in the condo townhouse uh, uh, stats in city of Mississauga and it is averaging around 0.78 million and if we talk about the last 12 month average for city of Mississauga uh, so as you can see like uh, for the last three months uh, uh, it is trying to find the bottom and god knows like uh, whether it will uh, hit another bottom in future month because interest rate had played a huge role and if we compare the month over month we have seen a price increase right in city of Mississauga from the month of October by 3.5 percent month over month and if we have to compare it with the top peak that we have seen a decline of 16.6 percent in the month of November from the peak of February and in the case of like month of inventory it's getting improved from the last couple of months as you can see july september august uh, october, october and june right now month of inventory is uh, going down kind of stuff but uh, 2.5 and averaging at 24 days average days on market so which totally as you can see like in the month of july in Mississauga, 3.4 was the month of inventory inventory was very high so currently like lot no doubt why the numbers are less over here because not new uh, lot a lot of new listings are not coming into the market in Miss Saga. So if you like this kind of data driven stats, please like subscribe and uh, put a alert sign uh, 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 on my channel and so that you come to know whenever I post a video so that you can make a much and more informed decision for your biggest investment. And these property, the reason for the uh, the reason why I make this property, uh, uh, sorry, the ma uh, make these videos are to educate you so that you can you can see which trends are going in which market you can analyze the stuff according to your needs right and then please share it with your friends family so that more and more people can ask, uh, make an informed decision and if anybody if you, you are looking for if you want to have a strategy call with me call me directly on the number provided or go to my website uh, you can and i will share the link of the track to my uh, uh, calendar so that you can book it from there as well in the video description below and uh, as I always say, uh, keep on hustling, keep on learning, keep on growing, be in touch, have a good one.